will see how to use the packing and unpacking operators in the Python. So let's move to our VS Code file by the name unpacking.py. Here I will explain you what the operator star and double star do. Basically star is also known as star args can say and double star is also called kw args basically kw means keyword arguments and args means arguments whether you are passing the arguments merging the collections or unpacking the sequences these symbols do a lot more than you think these are known as the unpacking operators unpacking operators so let's understand it with the example uh, it will be very easy to understand it with the example let's say I am explaining you the usage of star args only firstly I will make a function def add which takes arguments as a b and c and in this it will return as the simplest a plus b plus c now we have a list of numbers let's say there is 10 20 and 30 over there and if i want to if i want to pass these numbers individually to the function and i want the sum of the elements of this list then i will simply do print add and star i can use nums over here what will it do it will unpack the it will unpack the list into the individual arguments like in a like a equal to 10 b equal to 20 and c equal to 30 the syntax add star nums will break the list uh, or you can say unpacks the list into arguments so let's see the output and it is returning me 60 only because 10 plus 20 plus 30 is 60 so overall the star unpacks a list a tuple or a table into the individual elements moving ahead to the second example now I will explain you the usage of double star for keyword argument unpacking so if I am making a function let's say if I am making a function display which takes the argument name and age as and it prints I will use formatted string it prints the name is age years old and uh, if I am in storing the information in a dictionary let's say the name here is my name only and age here is age here is 20 I have used equal to here mistakenly age here is 20 and if I am display if I am calling the function display and double star I will use info because if I use single star here if I use single star over here then it will uh, what will it do it will unpack the list unpack the list means in the name section it will take this item this whole item so it can't be processed clearly that's why I have used double star over here double star basically unpacks a dictionary into the keyword arguments okay or you can say double star what do double star do double star basically unpacks the dictionary keys as parameter parameter names so in the name section it will be krishna and in the age section it will be 20 so let's uh, run it you can see this is 20 years old so this is the uh, application of double star which is used to unpack a dictionary into the keyword arguments moving ahead how we can use single star and double star in our functions and let's create a function let's create a function 
by the name def greet all greet all and it will take name as an argument star name for name in for name in names basically i am using a loop and if i give it a names and it will just print in a formatted manner hello name and if i am calling the function greet all let's say the name is aman daniel and here you can use sana so if i am running this code you are well aware about the that this is basically a tuple this is basically a tuple and in star names it will take this as a tuple and while we are using star then it will unpack this tuple and each element will go into the name the name equal to aman will become the first one the so hello aman hello daniel and hello sana will be there let's see the output by running it you can see there is no output uh, why because uh, there is some sort of error over there uh, i guess okay now it has printed hello aman hello daniel hello sana you can see over here uh, the terminal was slow last time now it has been fixed so basically star args allows variable number of positional arguments we can pass through at variable arguments basically uh, you can see here this is storing variable arguments we have passed three arguments over there and it's only one argument so by using star args we can pass variable arguments now the, the another example of double star kw args is basically we can use uh, let's make a function def show info and by using double star basically double star we can use in dictionary format we can use in double uh, dictionary format and if we are making for key comma value and for key value in kvargs dot items and here you can take idea that it's a kind of dictionary print f key corresponding to a value key corresponding to a value and if i am passing show info the name equal to pooja and age equal to 21 and branch let's say it's ec so if i run it then you can see that the name is this the age is this the branch is this how it happened because it's a dictionary and this uh, double star kw args or basically you can say a uh, keyword arguments take this as an element and we trans uh, traverse at kvox is now a dictionary and we traverse it for key value and we are just printing it in a formatted string so basically double star uh, kw args allows variable number of keyword arguments you can pass from there and there is another application of uh, these unpacking operators is we can merge the list let's say there is a list one of some elements uh, 12 24 and we have list two of some elements let's say 36 48 and 60 it's basically the table of 12 and we want to merge it so let's make a merged list over here which will contain list 1 because it will unpack the list right because the star operator will unpack the list list 2 and if i am printing the merged list if i am printing the merged list you can see if i am running the program you can see The list has been merged twelve, twenty four, thirty six, forty eight, and sixty over here. Same in same format, we can merge the two dictionaries also. Now I am gonna tell tell you about the main topic that uh, uh, the main uh, key thing 
about this topic let's say if I have three variables you are well aware if I do a b c equal to 10 20 and 30 then you are well aware that a equal to 10 b equal to 20 and c equal to 30 but if I do a star b and here I am making a list 10 20 30 40 50 60 over here okay now if I am printing print a print b print c let's guess what the uh, what they are going to print basically a b c will contain a star b and c will contain only three values so a will contain the first element right so it will print 10 only and c single so c will also print last element that is 60 only so the element in between will be printed by b right and in the form of a list 20 30 40 and 50 this is the expected output let's see by running it you can see the output is clear and we were right at that place so basically the star unpacks the iterables and double star the unpacks the dictionaries we double we use double stars to unpack the dictionaries and single star to unpack the iterables like listables it is used in function calls, definitions, assignments, and merging. This is known as assignment. We are assigning the value, right? And we have seen the example of merging two lists. And star args and double star kw args lit functions accept the flexible arguments. And you can you saw that uh, there is only one argument was over there, and we are passing three arguments to this by using the single star or double star because they are used as unpacking operators. So that's all about the unpacking operators in python in the next tutorial we will be look at tuple unpacking and destructuring which is a good tutorial on python uh, that's it for this video thank you guys for listening too patiently to this video thank you